Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are starting a new daily journal with me vlog. Um, and if you haven't seen any of these videos before, basically I take you through a week or, you know, Monday through Friday, depending on how I'm feeling, um, of how I journal every day, how I decorate my spreads, what spreads I work on um, throughout the week and things like that. So we're just going to get right into it. I do have two other videos of this kind on my channel, so I will link them down below. Or if I forget, you can just look it up on the playlist on my channel. Um, today we are going to be doing an orange theme. I'm just trying to see what stickers I want to use. Mm, I like those. I'm basically just trying to color match them a little bit. Um, okay, so I'm not loving that. I guess we'll just pull this one onto this side. We'll give it this one. And maybe this one to pull in the neon. It's a little more yellow than I'd like. But I think, oh actually, mm, that? Okay, I think I like that. So um, we're just gonna be decorating this page together. And I'm planning on doing something pretty simple. I feel like a lot of my journaling has turned to be pretty basic, not basic, but just very easy, um, doesn't take a lot of time. And that's just kind of how I've adjusted to having a bit of a busier life. And you know, what works for you works for you and there's no wrong way to journal. So just keep that in mind. Um, yeah, so. Just gonna be sticking these into like a triangle shape in the corner and this is uneven so i'm gonna peel it off really gently but yeah let me know how you guys are doing i would love to know i'm not sure when this video is going to be going up also i'm gonna switch these two because they're too similar um but yeah let me know what you guys are up to recently um what journal you're working on i always love to hear stuff like that um yeah, I think by the time this video goes up, I'll probably be back in school, um, which is a thing. <laughs> it's happening. Um, not sure I'm really ready for it, but you know, it is what it is. Um, okay. Oh, it's so crooked. I feel like it's hard to fix without getting up close and personal, and I don't want to do that on camera because I don't want like my head to be in the frame. I'm just going to pull it towards me a little bit and fix it so that it's laying flat or straight. Okay, there we go. Um... So yeah, I should be back in school, um, which is, well, I don't know how I feel about it yet, but um, I am moving into a house with three of my friends, which is really exciting. Um, and I still need to buy quite a few things for the house in my room, but we'll get there. Um, it is stressing me out a little bit, but I guess by the time you're watching this video, you'll probably, at least I'll probably know that everything turned out fine. So yeah. Um... Okay, I feel like I'm getting distracted by talking and it's not letting me put down the stickers correctly and it's gonna make this video so super long, but I feel like you guys actually enjoy my longer videos, which is interesting. Um, and so we're just gonna roll with it. Okay, finally, these stickers are laying down. Um, okay, focus, focus, there we go. I actually also have quite a few videos that I wanna film before I leave for school, so I have to get those done. Um, my schedule has probably gone back to going to uploading once a week. Um, today is Monday, August 15th. Yes. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, Ugh, this orange doesn't really match, does it? Whatever. Um, I'm probably going back to uploading once a week, which is totally fine. I hope I have enough videos stocked up. Um, last year I did, and I was able to film whenever I came home for like reading week or winter break. So hopefully that continues this year. Um, I do just have lots of ideas, but like honestly, no time to film, which sucks. Um, I just want to have like a huge backstock of videos before I go off for school so that, um, and I would like to have them edited as well, just so I can like upload whenever I need to, which should be every Friday. I feel like the spread is not turning out as cute as I hoped it would. Maybe I'm going to put one more sticker in the corner up there. Yeah. Okay. I need to do this one and maybe this one or is that, I feel like that's too yellow. Maybe this one. Okay. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm gonna be uploading once a week, probably every Friday. Um, but maybe once in a while I'll have an extra video for you guys. We'll see. I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to film at school. Um, last year I only filmed like little haul clips and things, and I don't think that's even gonna be happen. Well, actually, it might happen this year. We'll see. Um, yeah, I have no idea. But it'll definitely be something fun to get used to because I am really excited to move into the house. Um, I actually, fun fact, don't really know how to cook. I can follow a recipe, but like, 
I, I need a recipe is what I'm saying. Um, so we're definitely going to be learning how to do that. I am also excited to have a gym available to me again. Um, so yeah. Anyway, this was the most rambly first part of this journal with me ever. Um, <clears throat> but I hope you guys enjoyed. I will update you guys tomorrow to show you what I've done. Hi guys, welcome back to Tuesday's portion of this journaling vlog. Um, today we are going to be doing Tuesday's daily spread. I do have a page here that I'm saving for a book spread that I plan to do. Um, and yesterday I did do some journaling, so I made this spread for the book Only Love by Melanie Harlow. I did this spread for the book, what's it called? Only Him by Melanie Harlow. And then I did this spread for the book um, Only You by Melanie Harlow. So I read those books this past week and I finally got around to doing the bookish spreads. So love that. Um, and I think they turned out super cute. I love my hand lettering on this page. Um, and then I also actually filled out my expenses page for the month of July. Um, I've been putting it off, but I finally just wrote it all down on this cute little postcard. And yeah, also I do have a reel for how I created this August cover page on my Instagram, Letters to Valerie, if you're interested. But yeah, love how these two pages look together anyway let's get into today's spread um like i said it's tuesday so um i've picked out these two cute little washi stickers to use we're gonna go with a green theme today and i do need to grab my little paper box um and i did organize this yesterday so i'm just gonna pull out all my green paper hopefully i can get it all and sort through to pick out what colors i want to use so i think the green of this is really good as well as the teal from this and maybe I can also just pull in this color. I feel like those are a good match. Okay, we'll tuck everything else aside and the spread is probably going to be pretty simple. Um, yeah, I don't really have much to do today. I am going into work later on so it'll probably be pretty uneventful and I won't have much to write about. So we're just going to do two pages. If I end up having more to write about, I will likely just um, either do a post-it, or not post-it, a postcard page where I use the postcard um, and just write some extra thoughts, or I'll just um, end up writing about it tomorrow in tomorrow's spread. Oh, gosh. Oh, I didn't even show you guys yesterday's spread completed. So here is yesterday's spread completed. Just fill it out with some writing. Nothing too special. Um, okay, so yes, I'm just going to be gluing these pieces of paper in like sort of a pattern in the corner and I'm debating if I, <clears throat> excuse me, want to do like the picture in the other corner like this or kind of layer it here. I think I'm going to layer it just because um, the decoration is already taking up a lot of space and I do want to have enough space to write about my day. So hopefully it goes on straight. That looks pretty good. Cute. Um, and then I like to do just the opposite corner on the other side. So we're going to layer the paper. And um, most of this is origami paper or recycled paper. Um, you guys know I love to reuse things, so there's that. I'm just gonna glue this on, perfect. I am trying to do less washi spreads right now because um, I know that when I go back to school in a few weeks, I will have less time and will definitely be using washi a lot more. So while I have the time to use other pieces of stationery, I want to try my best to do so. Cute, love how that turned out. Um, I do need to make a little date label. Today is Tuesday. Let's pick a color. How about this one or this one? Let's see. Okay, this one's good. Okay, today I again is Tuesday. Tuesday, August 16th. I actually do have to hand in my two weeks today, which is unfortunate for my um, summer job. I definitely am gonna miss my coworkers. It was really fun working there. Um, I don't know if I ever mentioned, but I worked at like, <clears throat> excuse me, like a secondhand retail store. So basically we would buy in clothes and then um, sell them. Like we would buy clothes from people who were looking to get rid of old clothes and then we would resell them. So it's called Plato's Closet. I'm sure if you live in the US or Canada, you've heard of it. I don't know if it exists anywhere else, but yeah, so I was working there for the summer. It was lots of fun. I got so many cute clothes, um, but I do have to leave since I'm going back to school and I don't go to school in the same city that I live in or like that I was born in and like raised in. Um, so yeah, I am going to have to hand in my two weeks today. So I just need to remind myself to print it out, which is kind of sad, but it'll be nice to not have to go to... It's like, you. I feel like if you have a job, you know what I mean? When like you don't want to go into work, but having the money is nice and like being with your coworkers is nice. It's like a whole thing, but... 
okay the point was that i'm quitting my job today um or at least handing in my two-week notice but yeah that is it for today's spread i feel like it was pretty easy um and super cute so again these washi stickers i used are from either aliexpress or shein i'm not entirely sure and i think it turned out really cute so that is it for today's part i will see you guys tomorrow hi guys i am here for wednesday's portion of the journaling vlog um today we are just gonna use some washi and so i pulled out this gorgeous washi right here it's like a galaxy type washi with some hot gold foil and i think it's so freaking stunning it is actually a very gloomy day today so i hope the lighting on this part of the video is okay um and i'm just gonna put this down actually i realized i didn't show you yesterday's work so um i still haven't made this book a spread but i did write in yesterday's pages um so yeah there's it all filled out and i also had some private thoughts to journal about under this postcard so yeah i just stuck in this postcard put some matching washi down the sides and i thought it turned out really cute anyway let's keep going with today's spread um i am just going to speed this up so that it doesn't take me forever to get this washi down and i will see you guys in a second okay so here we are and I wasn't sure what color I wanted to use for my, what's it called, um, date little sticker. So I pulled out a few um, colors. So we're going to test them in my little scratch paper notebook right here and see which one matches the best. Probably going to be a no for that one. Mm, maybe, oh, this one's pretty good. And then we have has this one okay i think i'm gonna go with this one right here this is the tombow um dual tip brush pen in number 676 um i believe it came in the galaxy pack which is the first pack of tombows slash brush markers that i ever got um okay let's write out wednesday we're just gonna hand letter it without the thickening of these strokes ew that looks ugly we're gonna try again when Ms. Day. And today is August 17th? Yes. Okay. Perfect. And I'm just going to cut it out super quick. Again, these are just scraps of sticker paper that I get whenever I cut my stickers. I don't know if I mentioned that already um in this video i feel like whenever i do these journaling vlogs i end up repeating myself a lot when i'm explaining what i'm doing but hopefully you guys don't mind you guys seem to really enjoy the um last video that i made that was a journaling vlog so yeah hopefully you enjoyed this one as well i am actually not going to stick down the august 17th just in case i end up writing three pages um so i'll just leave that for when i'm actually writing my entry sometimes i really just never know how much space i'll need um, like things happen during the day that you don't expect and then you have to journal about it. So yeah Okay, I'm gonna stick this down Cute and I'll just leave that for later. So what? Uh, oh, I literally never mind. Okay, great So uh, that is it for today's spread super simple super easy. I will see you guys for tomorrow Hi guys, welcome back to Thursday's portion of the vlog. Um, I did fill out yesterday's spread with some writing um, and I did end up adding an extra page. I do have some thoughts to write on this page, so we're going to skip it and move on to the next spread right here. I think today I will also have three pages to write about. Um, and I do plan on using some stickers from Papershire. I wanted to use these ones right here, even though, to be honest, does that even make sense? Because I haven't really been... Um, you know, I use these ones. These ones are really cute and florally. And I've had them for longer. Okay, actually, change of plans. We're going to use these ones. I was going to use the other ones over there, but it's okay. So, T-H-U-R-S, August 18th. Okay, perfect. That should work out. So, basically, these are just stickers that I get from Papershire, which is a um, small, small sticker business. Sticker small business. Um... And I mentioned them a lot in my video, so it's no surprise if you um, have heard of them before from my channel. But I love Zenny stickers, and she always does these little box stickers as freebies with your orders. And I don't really use them in my planner, which is mainly what I buy her stickers for. But I do always find uses for them in my journal, which is really fun. I think I'm actually going to need to move it down a little bit more than that. Oh, there we go. 
Okay, cute. Um, and I'm just going to be writing out Thursday or Thurs um, and then August 18th. So I'm just going to peel these up super carefully and I will speed this up and see you guys in a second. Okay, so um, I did actually have a little mishap here, but that is a-okay. I just ended up gluing it back on. Um, I have my Tombow Fudenosuke hard tip here. We're just going to write out Thursday, August 18th. And that is, let me just make sure it's actually 18. Yeah, okay. Amazing. So that is it for today's part of the vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you tomorrow. Hi guys, um, welcome back to Friday's portion, which will be the last portion for this video, yes. Um, we are going to do some extra things today, which is kind of fun. Um, so here was yesterday's spread. I did fill it all out and I didn't work on anything else. So there's that. Um, right here though, I did hit 12.50 subscribers on YouTube, which is crazy. So we are going to make a spread about it. And since you guys have never really seen me, excuse the shaking, um, make this spread, I thought it would be kind of fun to show you all so um what i'm going to do is kind of match the way i did it last time when i hit 1200 subscribers um and i'm going to make like kind of numbers out of these little button stickers so first we're just going to trace out the numbers really lightly in pencil so that i kind of have a guide to follow when i'm doing the little um layering with the stickers and then i can just erase the excess after i know this looks really messy so yeah and then i'm going to write it write out subscribers underneath these colors are pretty random but honestly i don't mind um i think it's cute nonetheless anyway um i was debating if i should speed this part up i just wanted to give you guys a little bit of extra content for this video because i feel like it ended up being a little bit shorter than my other journal with me's or journal vlogs which you guys seem to really like the longer videos so yeah but anyway mm. I feel like I really don't have much to talk about, but I did get these stickers from a pen pal. However, I do think that they're from Umomo because I think I saw them there when I went um, shopping. So yeah, if you're interested, you can get them from Umomo, which is just kind of like a, I think it's Japanese or yeah, Japanese store. Um, and yeah. Okay, cute. That looks really good. I like that. Um, hopefully I have enough stickers. My gosh. I'm gonna change up the order a little bit just so it doesn't match the other side to a T. I did use some of these stickers when I was making um, a spread for my, actually for one of my videos, I was making my, finishing my 26 journal video and I used some of these button stickers. And honestly, I don't really have a use for them most of the time. So I just wanna kind of use them up, get them out of my stash. Um, okay, I don't like that that green is next to that green. And yeah. Okay, cute. Really liking this so far. It's looking really adorable. And um, basically in the past, whenever I did these like um, YouTube milestone pages, I would always um, just cut out cardstock numbers and then cover them in washi tape. Oh, I don't like how it touches the edge so closely when this one is kind of far apart. So we're just gonna make it a little bit of a skinnier zero. Um, yeah, so I used to do it a little bit differently, but honestly, this is so easy and I think it turns out really cute when I do it like this, so I don't really mind. Anyway, we are just about done with this. I'm really glad um, that it doesn't take that much time either, so that's great. I think the five and the zero are a little close to each other, but you know what? It just is what it is. I don't really care. Okay, one more sticker. Perfect. Well, I wonder if I can like kind of adjust this a little bit to make it less kind of um close to each other let's see i feel like that's pretty cute and you can definitely tell that it's 1250 so okay just gonna erase those pencil lines and i did bring out a few markers to write out the uh, word subscribers i don't know which color matches the best maybe this one yeah, that looks pretty good. Subscribers. Perfect. Really cute. So yeah, thank you guys so much for subscribing. It honestly means the world to me. Um, and I love that you guys love the videos too. I'll probably pass these on to my sister. Um, okay. 
Moving on, here I do want to do a bookish bed for the book A Million Kisses in Your Lifetime. I'm going to be honest with you, I saw this book hyped up on Book Talk and I did not really like it. I thought it was kind of weird. The premise, the characters, I just, ugh, yeah. Not my favorite. Anyway, um, we are going to move on to today's spread and I do have quite a few plans for today. So we're going to do three pages once again. I have pulled out some paper scraps as well as some cute little stickers from Honey Studios. I've had those for a while and I figured it was probably about time I used them. So I'm just going to rip up some paper to use. One, two, three. And as you guys can see, when I rip out my paper, honestly, there's no like method to the madness. It just kind of rips however, and I just let it be. Like, honestly, I'm not too fussed about things like that. I feel like a journal being messy and creative, there's nothing wrong with that, you know? Okay, should I decorate in the middle? No, we're just going to do in the corner. Just because I don't really, I don't know. I don't know why I chose to do the corner. Don't ask me. I feel like whenever I journal, it's just kind of random. Like, I really don't think too much about it, which is kind of nice. And like... Yeah. Anyway, um, there we are. Which drink should I put here? Maybe this one? Yeah, that's cute. Put a nice big one for the kind of covery page. And then we'll do this little umbrella. Really cute. Move on to the next page. I'll do it in this corner. So let's do some yellow. Anyway, recently I went shopping for some things for my room in my house that I'm moving into for school, so that was pretty exciting. I am a little bit stressed about moving, but I'm pretty sure everything will go fine, so yeah. Also, ugh, I hate that this paper is layered and it gets caught in the glue, but whatever. Oops. There we go. Really cute. And what drink should we put here? Let's do the little pink drink, and then in the corner, let's do the yellow drink. If it would come up, that would be great. There we go. Cute. We're going to do the other yellow drink in this corner right here. If I can peel it off. There we go. Oh, that's really cute, actually. Um, Here. Then we'll do this part. And we'll do here. Okay, nice. Um, I'll do this little drink here and then we'll put an umbrella as well to fill up the space. Okay, <clears throat> I feel like this spread turned out pretty freaking cute. These other two stickers, let me just stick into my kind of daily planner where I use up miscellaneous stickers. And this is where I just put like daily to-do lists and things. So let's see, where do I have space? Right here. Okay, we're gonna stick these little umbrellas in just for a little bit of decor um because you know i never like to let a sticker go to waste okay there we go cute let's write out the date i did bring out this pink marker right here it's probably not the perfect shade of pink but i don't really mind today is friday august 19th okay honestly this pink is very bright Okay, change of plans. We are going to switch it out, maybe for a yellow. <clears throat> so sorry about that. Um, yeah, I think a yellow would be better. And even if the yellow is a little bit brighter, it would just blend a little more seamlessly than um, this bright pink, in my opinion. Oh, I ended up writing August, but that is fine. It means the same thing. Um, let me get my trusty little scissors and cut it out. Oops. Perfect. There's the Friday. Then we have the August 19th. Whoops. Okay. There we are. Okay. I feel like this is actually really cute and really summery which oh so sad that summer's coming to an end by the time this video goes out it's definitely fall but um i hope this i don't know gave you some fond memories of the summertime if i can just peel this off that would be great there we go i'm gonna stick that right here in the corner and yeah looks like we are done for today i feel like that was pretty simple um and like pretty easy i'm glad i got to show you guys a different spread that i made like the 
1250 subscribers page and yeah so that was my week of journaling let's go back to the beginning and take a look where do we start the monday yeah so here we have monday a book spread that i need to do tuesday some private thoughts wednesday another private thought thing that i have to write about that i haven't written about yet um thursday really cute my subscriber milestone page another book spread that i haven't done clearly i'm a little bit behind and here we have five Friday spread. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you guys. Oh, it's so not closing. Okay, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!